Here at Salby's, as you might well have noticed, we love Norfolk. The list of my favourite things about the county are as long as my arm, and I'm not going to bore you with that. But once a year, something rather special happens where all things Norfolk get crammed into one place. That's right, we're at the Norfolk Show. The Norfolk Show is a showcase, a celebration of all that makes this county great. Yes, it makes for a belter of a day out, but more than that, it can provide you with a little peep into the lifestyle that we enjoy here in Norfolk. Now, if ever I have friends come and visit me in Norfolk, I have to give them a pint of Woodford's. It's a staple of our diet. We often came up here for a holiday and then uh, just moved up here about a year ago. Now, of course, food is a big part of everybody's life and here in Norfolk, we think we turn out some pretty decent grub. This looks like a pretty good place to find out more. It's not the countryside without cider, is it? And we all know that our county produces the best crisps out there. The one and only kettle juice. Norfolk apple juice here, it's gotta be worth a try. Perfect pork here, the biggest little butcher in Norfolk. This is black pudding and strawberry jam sausage. I'm not sure. Ooh. <laughs> After a quick look around here, I think you'll agree, as a county, we have got food production down to a fine art. And this little piggy went to market. Here at Salvi's, we sell dozens of equestrian properties, and we understand that it's a pretty unique lifestyle. One that is on full show here at the Norfolk Show. Now, of course, you don't need me to tell you that agriculture is a huge part of everything we do here in Norfolk. And here at the show, there's some seriously impressive cattle to be seen. Over 10% of the agricultural inputs in the UK are procured through Anglia farmers. The Norfolk Show, it, it is part of the social calendar. And, and, and here, yes, we do business and we do engage with our members, but it's very much a social society show too. We're from Jay Riley's. These machines are made in Holland for us. And oh. uh, we provide the UK, Ireland, um, and recently a couple of machines have gone to New Zealand. New Zealand? Yeah, New how, Zealand. How do you get them there? Well, Norfolk contacts, actually. Yeah. Norfolk contacts, yeah. they can get you anywhere. <laughs> and of course, we can't celebrate today's engineering without taking a look at the beautiful machines of the past. This is a Norfolk engine. Yeah. She came from the Peterborough show in 1910. We bought a fire engine, which yeah. is a bit strange. <laughs> <laughs> but it's, uh, it's quite great for the kids to be able to come and play with, ring the bell. We all walked here because we're a healthy school. Yay! Frog eating, yes, very big uh, source of protein, so feel free to come in and try them. Oh, what do they taste like? A bit powdery. But they don't... They don't cheers. Yep, cheers. Ready? Three, two, one, go. <laughs> Nutty. I want to say it's nice, but it's not. <laughs> it's a little bit dry, but... <laughs> and I've got everyday healthy eating, I've got winter entertaining, I've got some new Arga courses as well. Arga courses? Yeah. The amount of people I've sold houses with that don't know how to use an Arga is phenomenal. We yeah. need you. So I am the one to show them how to do it. Right, we've got triple layer, mint chocolate, bamberg and brown and caramel crunch if you want to try any. Nice. Let's go for... It's got me mint chocolate. Mint Where's this from? Uh, 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 King's Lynn, we're based. Now, as I know personally here in Norfolk, we're blessed with some seriously good schools. One such is Norwich School here. Cheers, lads. And of course, we can do football too. The mighty Canaries here. What's your favourite thing about Norwich, our city here? I would say the football team. Going up next year? Hopefully, I reckon so, I reckon so. You know, they're not doing their best at the moment, so... Nothing. No. So we've got the speed pass challenge where you have to get a rugby ball and you have to get it through the hole. Even the towns themselves are well represented here. Behind me, we've got Holt in a tent. Really nice town, good mix of uh, different retailers. Of course, you can't visit the show without taking a quick stop at the Grand Ring. The whole day is packed with fascinating events that showcase our heritage. Normal for Norfolk, I suppose. Describe Norfolk in three words. Fun, friendship, that's right, and learning. Yes. I, like that. I moved from London and it's so much more like relaxed and calm yeah, here, and I find right. everyone's a lot nicer. I really like the coastline. Oh, yeah. The coastline yeah. is very good. Favourite beach? Holcomb. Oh, the stars. The countryside. The countryside. The countryside, probably the beer. The beer. Yeah. <laughs> You're not the first person to say yeah. that. Absolutely bloody brilliant. <laughs> you heard it here first. <laughs> well, I for one have had a wonderful day as ever here at the Norfolk Show. If that little peep into our lifestyle has inspired you to perhaps look at purchasing a property in Norfolk, or indeed you have a Norfolk property to sell, we would love to hear from you. We've got eight high street offices and you can find us at www.sowerbees.com. We look forward to hearing from you.